Welcome back, so I forgot to show you that I leveled to SU69, so here you go. After that, I went and I leveled my Wild Hunter to level 200 and I did the 5th job, because why not, I just love the class. Next it was time to level up to 270, finally. Obviously it not happened like one after the other, but I'm not gonna sit here for like 7 hours. Oh, and I farmed, and I farmed, and I farmed, and I farmed. <laughs> it's not interesting, so here we go. Now it's the lane turn to go to level 200. Again, potions, the best thing of this event. I don't know why you won't do that. And thanks to the dude who told me to do this quest again. Next is the zero turn, but I didn't have a lot of potions. And you can see the screens keep getting in the way. It's so annoying. I used whatever I had and I stopped at 163. This is just to show you how shitty this event is. I use all my coins every day, didn't get anything. Next I made my Hato, which was pretty much a pain at the start. It wasn't much fun, the damage was great. But the more I played, the more fun it got, the more skills I had. It became pretty easy just to go left and right. I stopped at 149. I then completed chapter 4 of the pyramid event. Here you have a sneak peek of how I was training for like hours each day, just so I can level up. This is my basic AFK ball thing, just place the things, Janus on the right and the, and the fountain on the top and just keep throwing the morning star to the right until the wave is done. Once the cooldown is finished, go collect the money and repeat. Next I did a quest where you have to kill 5000 the dragon things, it's related to the guild stuff. I don't know why you would need to do that beside having the research thing because the, once you finish this once a week, you get some points to actually use it on researching stuff for your guild, personal tab for whatever. If there is like a different thing, please do let me know. And a lot of time later I can show you 271. In this segment I show you that you're not the only one who gets nothing when you cube. You're not the only one who wastes billions after billions of mesos and you get nothing in return. Now it's the cane turn to level up to 200 and once again I did as I was suggested to do the haven quest at the last level. And this is the second thing I show you but you're not the only one with the very bad luck. I have very bad luck also. Another few bills spent on this superior Galax ring, my first one, and I get nothing. I just stayed under 17 stars. Now it was the Phantom turn to level up in this event. This event is the golden one, it's the newer version. Every 200 you get the regular paper, paper dragon, and every 300 you get the musical box, which gives you a lot more EXP. This time turns I'm not the fastest runner, I'm the slowest runner. Luminous finally leveled to 272. This Sunday it was the Magnificent Souls event. You get 5 times the chance to get the Magnificent Soul. But still, after all those souls, I just gained one. The Queen. Finally it was time for me to level up my Phantom to 210 because I need the critical rate. So I don't waste it on my Legion or my Hyper Stats just here. So I leveled it up using potions all the way to level 200. I mean 199. Then I did the Haven quest, because why not? After that, I used all the coupons I gained from the masks you can farm these days. It gets like, I think, 5k to level up to from 200 to 210, something like that. So I just used all the coupons, that's it. Next I made a shade. I don't really have anything to note, beside the fact that the class is very immobile. And most attacks just root you in place, at least until 4th job. Next it was Chan Lina's turn to level up to 210 because they give you critical rate and boss damage. Again, great link skill. After being at Odium for quite a bit, I wanted a new map. Also, I didn't get such a great EXP rate, so I changed my map a few times to find this map. It's a great map for Luminous very much. You can use Reflection and it goes all the way to the top. If you can one shot, it's a great map. I just go left and right, left and right using this stuff use my summons on the top because I can't one shot just yet and once the summons need refreshing I just go collect the coins press the summon button and repeat now just so you understand what I'm doing every day to level up I'm buying all the five VIP coupons you can buy from the event it's like 30 minutes each so it's two and a half hours then I buy all the 15 minutes coupons you can buy also the time three and the time two and beside that, whatever coupons you get from maybe a daily gift or the event like check thing, the daily login for the event thing, 
whatever you can, I just use it and level up as much as possible. Next on the EXP bus is the Zero, which has the annoying popping screens all the time when you level him up to like a certain level. Obviously 199, I did the Haven quest and that's it. Our next boy, the higher grow, also used potions to level up all the way to 200. I don't really like the link skill, but why not? Higher legion always works good. Now we have the fire poison and you can see some sort of a pattern that I'm too lazy to do the haven quest for now on. So all the characters will just level to 200 with another potion. Next one to 200 is the dawn warrior. However, one problem, we do not have enough potions. So we didn't stop at 200, we stopped short. Let's go return this. And I'm gonna go pass out. <laughs> After I had risen from the dead, I leveled up my shade using the potions to 200. As usual. Or did I? Now the AB. This one was a bit annoying because I had to level the character itself to level 131 because it was at 120 so it took me quite a bit now that I have more potions I'm going back to Salim Shady to finish the job now we go back to the Dawn Warrior to finish the job over here as well 5 levels it's not much but I still needed to get the potions Luminous to 273 finally this map is great EXP by the way I now present to you a very cursed hat I spent like over 9 bill on this hat and I didn't even get to 20 star. I'm obviously aiming for 22, 21, but I didn't even get to 20 stars. Every time I get to 20 stars, which was like one or two times, it got destroyed. After a very long farm, finally you can see level 10, Janus can farm easily, thank you. Next one is the AB to 210 because I want the link skill at level 3. I think it's like what, double the one of 120, I'm not sure though. More percent damage, more good, yay. And this is it for this episode. And also it's probably gonna be the last one, just so you know, because I'm very close to finishing the story. I have like one or two more streams to do to like clean up all the quests. And I'm pretty much gonna be finished. I might do like weeklies, but I'm not gonna do a video about it because it's not interesting. I'm just doing the weeklies in case or if I want to come back or there is going to be like something very cool that's going to happen something like that I might not even do that who knows because I came here again for the story I didn't come here for the bossing or stuff like that I don't care about that anymore so that's pretty much it I guess next series is going to be on the next game which you will see but that's it hope you enjoyed this one if you did thank you if you didn't just a few minutes, you're good. And also, it's the last episode, so cut me some slack. Keep stay safe, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.